My name is Rex Chapota. I work for Farm Radio Malawi as Executive Director. Radio is so important in Malawi, not only because it is a channel of communication, but it is the only major channel of communication which can reach our farmers out there in the rural communities. You know, in Malawi, 90% of the people live in rural areas, and most of them are smallholder farmers. And if you ask them a question to say, where do you get most of the information? They'll tell you that it is through the radio. Why? Because you will not find extension workers down on the ground because the extension workers are not there. So radio is indeed a key piece if we're to change the way farming is done in our country. One thing which excites me about the work of farm radio is that we're not doing something which has not been done before. Radio has been a key vehicle of communication for so many times in Africa and of course in Malawi. But it is the way we handle radio programming. One of the key things we have learned through the African Farm Radio Research Initiative, it is a participatory way of doing radio, where we make the farmer the centerpiece of the programming. So we see that the way we handle radio is not only about giving information to the farmer, but also giving the voice to the farmer. One thing we've understood is that farmers hear listening to fellow farmers because they know it's real. As much as we appreciate the role of knowledge partners, researchers, scientists, but we have to know that farmers usually learn from one another and the platform of radio gives them this opportunity. Therefore, radio is a big trigger in terms of the way extension can be efficient on the ground. With few numbers of extension workers available, we do really see that radio is giving that platform to the farmers out there to be able to be engaged on what they're passing through, what they can be able to do in their gardens. For example, we see that through radio, we can be able to talk to farmers in terms of the whole cycle of their production. And they can be able to follow the programs also in the same way, at the end of the day, helping them to do the right things at the right time. So to us, farm radio, it's not just about extension, but it's about right extension at the right time in the way farmers want to hear the information. You know, farm radio is not about just having a radio program on air. It is about a radio program that impacts farmers' lives. One thing we've understood is that the more farmers listen to radio programs, the better knowledge they have concerning that practice. And if they've got more knowledge, the better skilled they'll be to be able to practice that in their own garden. And they do it right, their production increases, and they become more food secure. So our radio programming does not end up to the point of farmers just listening to the program, but doing what they listen, which changes the way their production takes place and indeed increase their food security situation in the household. One great thing that has been outstanding in our work since 2007 under the African Farm Radio Research Initiative is about getting evidence on how radio works. Because if you go out there to ask people to say, does radio work? Everybody says, yes, it does, but how? What is the evidence? Therefore, we are so thankful to the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation for supporting us as Farm Radio International to do this kind of work where we can be able to get the evidence on how radio works and how it works for our farmers out there. We have seen through this kind of research work that indeed a farmer who listens more to radio programming has got better knowledge than the one who doesn't listen to in any way. So this just shows that radio is a critical issue as far as changing the way production happens at the farmer level. Therefore, the work of farm radio can be described as something which is triggering a lot of work happening on the ground for farmers. And I can confidently say that radio helps us 
to release knowledge and we can be able to say indeed where knowledge flows, food grows.